She came, she saw, she opined. Governor Jan Brewer is just back from an aerial tour of the Tucson sector's border with Mexico. In tonight's Not On Your Side Border Watch, when she got off the chopper, she had an interesting opinion about what she had seen. Craig Smith joins us from the newsroom now to explain. Craig. Jennifer, the governor was fired up. She was repeating her stand that the Arizona border is a dangerous place, far from secure. As she put it, well, let's just hear from her. The governor rolled up in an Arizona National Guard helicopter. Soon after her feet hit the tarmac, she was describing meeting with border area ranchers, fearful about illegal border crossers and smugglers crossing their land. She says for a secure border, Arizona needs more technology, more fencing, more people. We need boots on the ground. My goodness, you know, I can't believe, I just got back from um, Afghanistan. Um, they can secure the borders over there. Why can't we secure our border here? Surprisingly, no one challenged her about that right away. When we got a chance for a follow-up, we did. Governor, when you, you reference Afghanistan, uh, there's often complaints that the Afghanistan border is quite porous, that, that uh, militants and terrorists move back and forth and almost at will. Well, you're right. You are right in, 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 in that regards, but I tell you, they got boots on the ground and it'd probably be a heck of a lot worse if it wasn't. This gets back to the debate over what a secure border is and whether we'll ever satisfy all the different people fighting over that definition. For some people, it's no illegal crossers. For others, the buzz phrase is operational control, a tight grip that squeezes traffic to a trickle. Border Action Network says that's already happened. What's your definition of when you know you've achieved it? Yeah, when, definitely when we have operational control. I don't think we're ever going to be able to address every single person that's going to cross the border, but we're definitely in control of the border as it is right now. Now, the governor toured the border without talking with the Border Patrol. She says she met with members of the Border Patrol Union and with National Guardsmen involved with border security, but not official leadership of Customs and Border Protection. When I asked why, her press secretary said several months ago, CBP invited her on a tour, then took back the invitation without explaining why. We've sent a question to Homeland Security Headquarters in D.C. to hear their side of this. All right, what's the governor's definition of a secure border? Did she explain that? Well, she says she'll believe the border is secure when she hears that from ranchers there. Craig, thank you.